Okay, this is Rocket Boy looking at another engine from the same builder. Uh, this is a two-cylinder version. It makes quite a bit more power, upwards of uh, 12,000 watts. Um, it's got a 15 or 20,000 watt uh, ST generator head over here, and of course the big twin cylinder mounted on two big heavy I beams, and it's bolted down to the ground with elastomeric lead lag dampers from a Eurocopter. It works very well for isolating vibration. He's got a battery with jumper cables, so he can connect it to any battery for the electric starting system. This is a power and and uh, starting system kit that you just add on to uh, this um, GTC engine. Uh, he's got fuel dis quick disconnect so he can add uh, any fuel source to it he wants to, whatever is convenient. And as you see, he's got a cooling system over here with a Grunfoss electric coolant circulating pump, which we've found work very, very well with these engines. Never had one fail. A holding tank for adding some thermal uh, stability. And then he also has, like the other generator, a 12 volt fan. And then on the other side of that, there's another fan. So he's got backup cooling fans. And, of course, he even has a spare radiator hanging here, ready for hurricane season. Um, he used the same uh, Murphy system here for a solenoid for pulling the rack to shut it off. And uh, has a, right up here is the, the Murphy uh, gauge. Goes to the Murphy relay uh, control box. And, of course, the coolant temperature is sensed right here as it comes out of the cylinder head. So we'll start it up, let it run, and I'll shut it down. Here's the uh, push button shutdown switch that uh, sends a signal um, to the relay delay box up there to shut it down. That's it. Thanks for watching.